That's us. Oh can never knew Nigerian men are this romantic. Can we have a little commotion for this beauty? Happy birthday to guys how have you guys been so another week in london it's been great um the quality of life our quality of life has improved like i'm really grateful it's amazing guys 24 hours light like there's never been a time with no light that is groundbreaking for me coming from you know a country where that was really difficult like we struggled with that internet yes even though in nigeria we do unlimited internet when it gets to a certain point like like in the month the quality of the internet reduces and it just gets crappy and annoying but here there's always internet like even when you don't have internet on your phone and you go to malls you go everywhere like you get access internet some buses have internet it's just crazy but of course you know i would always say it's there's nowhere like home there's nowhere like home it's just it's just different at home like it's like my birthday in a few days my birthday is on 14th and i ordered an outfit another thing that i've been enjoying guys as someone who loves fashion access to different brands oh my god it's been amazing i want to be careful in case i want to return it Ooh, my dress is here i'm not going to show you guys fully because then you know, it's just it just came like guys what's up I just finished filming a video, a reel for my Instagram. If you haven't, so I'm gonna leave the link to my Instagram here. I'm more of a content creator than I'm a YouTuber, so you're going to enjoy my page on Instagram. So check it out. Check out the reel that I filmed. It's getting late. It's if Tara will be in in like 20 minutes, so I need to cook if Tara now. So I'm going to be making yam. That yam that I cut and I put in the freezer the other day. Here. I'm just going to put some in the pot. And that's all. Without defrosting it. I just brought it outside the freezer. So this is what you want to do if you're in the diaspora. Okay? Okay. about you but I put sugar in my yam so this is what the yam looks like you can see very nice so it's day 13 of Ramadan Ramadan Mubarak to my Muslim buddies how has it been how has it been for me um, fluctuation of Iman honestly you know we keep picking ourselves back I read um, a book an Islamic book recently where you know the prophet said that the most important thing to Allah is Tawbah right so Allah doesn't actually want you to be perfect like when I heard that like it, it put things in perspective for me because you know Allah already created angels that are perfect like all the angels do is just praise Allah like they just praise Allah they do not sleep they do not eat they do not shit I'm sorry for lack of better for words they just praise Allah so Allah created us to be like this he knows that our emotions are going to get the better of us but, but the most important thing he wants from us is to return to him in Tawbah so yes Allah loves the people that does Tawbah and Tawbah means like constantly seeking for forgiveness I hope I'm right I'm going to leave the meaning here if I am not so yeah repentance and all of that so may that make it easy for us yeah let's go <laughs> 
guys i am at self ridges this is where all the designer brands are at we have a good we have Bulgari. We have Givenchy. We have Chloe. Then, of course, we have Chanel. Because why not? I'm just doing a happy dance right now. This is Jack Humors. And this is my favorite from Jackie. The Bambino bag. Hey guys, birthday prep. This just came in from Naked. One of my birthday outfits. My first birthday in London. Ah, I'm excited and it's a big number. I miss home though, because if I was home, I would have a lot of people helping me out. My buddies, David, David and Daniel. If you guys are watching this, I miss you guys so much. Look at this metallic jacket. It is giving naked. Naked really has nice stuff. It just did their name that I don't understand. This is for my birthday. It's like a suit set, and I'm going to be styling it down. I cannot wait. Birthday in Ramadan. This place is giving me Dubai vibes. This is London. This is Dubai. This is London. This is Dubai. Inside Stratford Mall. And I'm just walking through their home depot aisle. They have really pretty things. And I like how they sectioned it into like design. So you can easily pick like if you're the neutral kind like me just come here pick what you want more colorful stand here with green and blue they're so beautiful oh my god how gorgeous is this wow my first time in stratford mall i too was one that brought me we came shopping for him and girl and our kitchen items <laughs> i just said to come to the kitchen like aisle and i'm loving it but i'm not picking anything nah today is for my husband because i usually do that we'll go out to shop for him and i end up like doing the shopping guys this mall is big what stratford mall oh mango i love this jacket it's cute wow it's a big mall guys I am building a capsule wardrobe for Mr. Z. Birthday shopping. I'm looking for eels, guys. And I'm at TK Maxx. This is cute. Ted Baker. $39.99. But why need it? Why I need it? Stratford Mall is so big and so beautiful. It's nice. It actually has everything in it. Zara, H and M, Arquette, other stories. MS, you name it. Then it has TK Maps. Wow. Hey guys, birthday girl checking in. <gasps> it's my birthday very soon. Guys, 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 I'm excited, but I'm also like you feel sort of weird because I don't have friends here. I do have friends, but my abroad people got me covered. Angie Abel is going to be beating the face to perfection, and her husband is going to be taking 
gorgeous gorgeous jpegs i'm going to leave their handle here you can follow them when you see the results so yeah i'm just getting ready to go for the shoot i've just been busy all this while like trying to shop for outfits and i really did i think i got like really nice pieces i'm going to show you a few of them okay this pu jacket like metallic is giving metallic vibe it's just this one is from naked it's so nice if you want i could link it down below this fit too is from naked it's like a marble pattern um cord set like a suit set blazer and pants and i'm going to be using this view we have another suit set here it's like this one is just amazing like i'm going to insert a picture of the model wearing it here it just got me like the pants is cargo it's just it's just beautiful i can't wait to style this and i'm going to Ta -da! then the star of the day my birthday dress guys can we give it up for this beauty you know can 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 we have a little commotion for this beauty this is beautiful guys look at it it is fully embellished it's in my color neutral oh my god i love this baby right here it has like beatings all over it oh i'm obsessed it's it's my 30th it, it's my 30th birthday like everything needs to be perfect <laughs> i actually wanted to use like nigerian designers but they didn't come through for me like the timing and everything was weird this is the shoe i'm gonna be wearing with the dress all my shoes are actually from TK Maxx. How gorgeous is this? Like I love the heel and I love the fact that I block heel and I bought pieces that I know that I could, you know, wear again. So on that note, I'm going to catch you guys at the shoes. Balloons are here. Daddy. <laughs> A doll, mashallah. She did that. It's all hot. It's all hot. The outfit. Oh, my God, I knew that German at this romantic. So I can see your other leg. Yeah, that's it. Outfit number two. Hey, I'm going to go to the YouTube. Now, look at your beautiful wife. <laughs> oh I got gifted this plant guys anyone that knew me back in Nigeria I am like a plant lover I have a bunch of them and I actually really miss my plant when the kitchen I know that whenever we're in the kitchen I'm always so excited this episode of cooking with Zoe. I really just love trying out recipes, simple recipes, not the difficult ones because I like cooking but I don't love it. I don't know if you understand. I like food so I have to like cooking but I don't love. Anyways, today I'm going to be making banana bread and I have like really nice easy banana bread recipe i usually like having like some sort of snack in the fridge so yeah i'm just going to be taking you through my easy banana bread recipe let's go <laughs> so i have wondered what to use your very very ripe bananas for my husband really likes bananas but you know men sometimes it's, we, i just buy them and it doesn't take them so i like making like large batch of um, banana bread with my ripe banana like overripe banana so I don't throw this away
guys, so I was running late for this hospital appointment and I thought I was late. I made it just in one minute. And now I'm making this video, so I'm probably late. Catch you guys later. The flower. This flower is so cute, guys. Look at the red one. Wow. So this is it. Supposed to be a skirt and a boot hey, moment. Sweatshirt. This. Guys, it's almost iftar and I'm making moi moi. So I've had this being soaked for about five minutes. I want to show you guys how I peel my beans without using my hands. I use a blender, guys. I'm going to show you now. So you just want to make sure you're using half beans and half water like this. Do you understand like half beans half water then use any kind of blender that you have and you want to use pulse not blend make sure you're pulsing it by the time you pulse it for like like 10 times your beans is peeled that's all guys that is all so this is the end result you have your peeled beans yep our moi moi butter is ready guys if you're in the diaspora and you don't have pan or tin or leaves this method is what i use it is so easy put your butter your fish your egg put everything and you stick it right into the oven and bake so you're just going to cover it like this with a foil paper Stick it into the oven and then pour water in the pan. It's important that you add water to the pan. And then just bake at 180 degrees Celsius for like 45 to 60 minutes. You keep checking with your toothpick to know if it's done. Then you push it away. That's all. Moi Moi is ready in all its glory so this is what we have you can just put in like a toothpick or a stick to see if it's done I already did that and it's done so yeah are you going to be trying this recipe? let me know flower shopping again I'm trying to decide between this flower and this one I really like the white though it's my birthday tomorrow! Yeah. I don't know. I'm just always so happy at the sight of flowers. I think I'll go for this. I'll go for this. Yeah. Let's go here. I'll be my Yeah! Let's go. Happy birthday. Yeah. <laughs> You're the best day girl. You're the best day girl. One time for the best day girl. Yay! For the best day girl.